Hello friends. So, how did you find the story? I am sure you must have enjoyed listening to it. Now, let's have a brief discussion on the story so that we can answer the questions given in the exercise. Button. Button is a short story about a couple who is going about their daily lives when one day they find a mysterious packet sitting at their doorstep. Inside, there is a gadget that resembles a doorbell underneath a protective glass dome. The couple is given a button delivered by a mysterious man, Mr. Stewart. And if they press the button, somewhere, someone they don't know dies and they receive a payment of $50,000. The story revolves around the couple's conflict, which compares the urge to get rich with moral values and humanity. The wife Norma is found constantly contemplating the pushing of the button and the husband opposes her, saying that the wealth cannot bring contentment and mental peace to them. Murder is murder, whether you kill by hand or by desire. The death of Arthur transfixes Norma as she had pushed the button in the end and wanted the money whereas the amount turned out to be Arthur's insurance policy. The theme of the story is to never let money get the best of you. Listen to the people who love you. Remember, you could seriously cause damage for your own pleasure and desire. Now, let's discuss some difficult words and their meanings that we saw used in our lesson. Frown. When someone frowns, it means they make an unpleasant face. Gadget. It is a small mechanism. Curious. People who are curious are eager to learn more. Intrigue. Intrigue is a synonym of surprise. Shrugged. One shrugs when they don't know something. It's a gesture with shoulders. Eccentric. Something odd or strange. Impulsively. Immediately, spontaneously, when someone reacts without thinking. Swallowed. To eat without chewing. Scoffing. To taunt somebody or tease with words. Glared. To look at something without blinking an eyelid. Appalled. It is a condition in which someone might feel unhappy, loathed or not at their best. Stacking. It is usually used for the dead. It means to pile up. Furor. A state of extreme happiness or anger. Alright, now since you know the meaning of the difficult words, you may reread the story again. And you will find it easier to understand. For the question and answers, you must visit the next part of this lesson.